yeah. That's right, guys and gals, I'm doing an homage to my favorite Marvel character, the human mutate, the merc with the mouth, Wade Winston Wilson, aka Deadpool. He's my favorite because he's got some sweet sword skills, some sweet gun skills, he can teleport, he can't die, thank you Wolverine. He breaks the fourth wall all the time, he's amusing and incredibly, incredibly inappropriate. What's not to like? So why not paint your nails to look like his, his likeness? I don't know. <laughs> Today's video is going to be pretty short because the nail art's pretty basic, really easy to follow along, so I hope you guys like it. Thanks. <laughs> okay, you can see we're only using three colors. Red, black, and white for the eyes. Also, you'll notice a lack of bedazzling happening this time. I have refrained, I've given up a lot, and I'm not going to put gems on this. I'm not. I started with all of my nails red. If you want to do some red, some black, change it up. Do what you feel. I'm only doing the actual Deadpool logo on one of my nails. But that is entirely up to you and your artistic mind. I decided to go with a thick black line through all of my nails that don't have the logo on it just to change it up a bit and make sure every nail has something going on a little fancier than just one coat of polish. All of the off nails are looking good and they're ready to go. I put some masking tape down, actually some washi tape, just to make sure the line between two halves of the Deadpool logo are straight because I don't really trust myself to just freehand two straight lines that are perfectly spaced. You don't have to put tape down if you're super confident that you can make those straight lines. It just was easier for me. You can paint over the tape and it doesn't matter because you're just going to peel it off and have a perfectly straight centered line. I took a dry, small, very fine paintbrush and did two half circles on either side of the washi tape in black. I did need to go over them a couple of times just to cover in all of the little holes that you could see the red through. So It's nice having the tape there because you can do just a full circle if you want so that they're actually even and just peel it up when you're done. I prefer using washi tape or like painter's tape as opposed to using scotch tape because scotch tape tends to take the nail polish with it when you peel it up once you've done once you're done painting around it. So tape that isn't too sticky but will lay on your nail long enough to cover it up. And there we 
go. Heal it up. Nice straight line. I actually do go back in and bring the lines closer together just so there's a little less red in between them. Make sure the corners are even and it looks nice. Then I come in with my two-sided daughter and some white paint. Oh, oh. Never mind. Never mind that. You saw nothing. I come in with some white paint and just make the eyes. Some of the versions of the logo have his eyes being the skeptical, funny eyes that he does. Some of them have them as just white dots. It's easier to do the white dots. You can see I started with the paintbrush and then I got a little less confident and came back in with a daughter. And there you go. Super sweet Deadpool nails. Awesome. Don't forget to clear coat. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys next time.